Hello everybody, this is Lindy again. So, sorry about that. I'm going to do a walkthrough. Uh, a little bit better one than I did before, simply because people have asked to see more of it. You know, um, they have a lot of, in the older ones, original stuck on stuff. This is going to be all remodeled, as well as that one. Now that one, a gentleman has been in that one since. Train, sorry. Trains come through here all the time. So that one, um, the gentleman who lives there has been here since 1972 or 1973 when the, uh, this owner purchased the place. So he's the longest resident we have. <coughs> he is now an older man. And um, that's about it. I, he still has his 50s. I believe he said it was aqua blue. You'll see we're walking through the neighborhood. Aqua blue refrigerator. Still works, still running. He repair has it repaired. I don't know if he does it himself or whatever. So we're coming down here. I just came out of my house. And um, they used to have mobile homes in here as well on the empty lots. They put those in. And now they're putting in modular homes. So this is a modular home, and they rent that out. And that one is a, a two bedroom and they put a deck on it. They put decks on all of them. And this is the original house. I think that's been remodeled a couple of times. It still has original floors, a lot of original stuff inside. I've been inside it. And this is the work garage where all their tools and all their work equipment is here. And then back here is when they get ready to go to the dump, they collect everything back here. Then they go to the dump. And here's another modular again with the deck and you can see right back there I'm trying to find it there it is the train station right there okay and so then the, we none of us know why this little shed is here but the shed is original to the place it's just a little shed don't know what to say yeah, they have stuff in it I don't know what it was used before. I think it might have been for mail, but I'm not sure. And then over here, you're gonna see these cars, but you'll see more of the original homes. Here's a modular, right there, right there. These were all original. See the tiny little place right here? This is a modular, and we still have a few mobile homes. And I think when they're gone, then they'll put modulars in. Modulars cost them about twenty, thirty thousand dollars. Some are forty. I was talking to the owner, and she was telling me how much some of them cost. Uh, here's a really tiny, tiny place. One of the smaller ones right here. Okay. And if you go back over here. I'm trying not to get any license plates. Back in here somewhere is a little tiny, oh, it's way back here. I'll show you. That's our dumpster. This used to be what they'd call a community bathroom. They'd take showers in here and they had toilets. They'd turn it in to an apartment. And then here's a modular they put in there. Everybody's fixed it up pretty well. Of course, here's an original right here. And they did have this whole thing full of these wooden boxes and we could all plant in them. But slowly but surely they're taking them out because people aren't using them. And it's a good place we used to, when I moved in here, well now it's been about 10 years ago, we had tons of these boxes we all planted, we all had vegetables. Not anymore. So, way back in here, I'm gonna show you the tiniest place here. It was a garage, right here, and they turned it in to a room and added a toilet and what a kitchen, and it's now a little place. It was a garage, guys. So anyway, so here we go. 
and I'm going to show you another original stove. They've had it sitting out here forever. They pulled it out of the house. <clears throat> so I'm walking back here just to show you this. And there it is. Original stove. It's a 1930s. All enamel cast iron. Pretty, pretty nifty. Just show you up close. And that came out of the original house, which I just showed you. So, I want to get out of the sun. This is that 1950s mobile home. Still here, still rented. The lady's been here forever. She rents it out. She doesn't live in it anymore. She's an older woman. And we're going to go over to the other side, and then I'm getting a little bit tired. I know, it hasn't been a very long walk, but it's hard for me to walk. So I'm going to show you some of the other side past the house. And these are our recycling bins. Everybody does. The mailboxes. We're going to go to the other side. Now, the house, they used to rent the bedrooms out with a community kitchen and shared bathrooms and they have two inside which I don't have keys to get in and I haven't asked so if I see the owner I might ask him if I can show that to you but we have right in front of us this house right here and that has <coughs> that's another house they built and that has shared kitchen and uh, bedrooms and they run around four or five hundred dollars a month for just a bedroom you have shared bath and shared kitchen and here's more of the original these have been remodeled then there's a modular and then there's ba mobile homes back here back over in here this is just one section there's like four sections like this this go around in a circle i'm gonna walk back see the back of a tiny little house right here right this blue right back oh right there yeah this is more modulars now they're gonna have their hundred year celebration in seven years and the city's been talking to them about being a historical site Here's modular, and here's the original cabins, or cottage, I call them cottages. So there was a lot of ground space they used to put mobile homes in. Somebody's got an old Corvette. Okay, and you can see where they had parking for each one. And here's another one right ahead of us. I hope I'm holding this camera since I can't see it. Here's another one that they have in front of us. Another tiny. This yellow one is a tiny one. They've got it boarded up. I think they're working on it. And there's more. And there's two more roads of these. But we're not going to walk all of them. I just thought I would show you some of these and that's our trip around this little community not all of it but most of it thanks for watching i'll talk to you later camel